Hello YouTube modeling community. Welcome to Morris Custom Model Shop. As always, God bless all here. God bless America. Please. Uh, just a little quick uh, mail call and uh, stash update. Uh, I've got a few cards in lately and picked up a couple things from uh, uh, Model Roundup. Just want to show you. Uh, first off, uh, first one I got was from Trevor over at Mooger's Models. Got his card. Everybody's built this Ford FD-150 and it, every one of them turns out beautiful. Uh, I've, got, I've got one in my stash and tend to build it sooner or later. But just hadn't got around to it yet. And Trevor also sent me the sticker. Uh, then the next one to come in was from our good friend in Austria, Gary G. Uh, a really, really great fella. A lot of fun to watch. Uh, fantastic musician. Uh, he's just so creative. He, he, his, all his ideas are just so off the wall and original. Uh, I can't get enough watching this stuff. Really, really is enjoyable. And uh, then yesterday I got in Russell's card from Russell Model Cars. That's where his camera is going backwards the way it does. It's hard to keep track of. But there's Russell's card. So I got all those cards in, and I finally found me a little folder to put them all in. A little. Uh, uh, photo album. I think most of them will fit in it. Some of, some of them are a little bit big and uh, I'll probably do something different with them. But then from uh, uh, Auto World or not Auto World uh, Model Roundup I'm sorry uh, ordered me a set of Pegasus Raider wheels. Uh, I'm a nut about Kragers. I think every hot rod in the world ought to have Kragers on it. You know, uh, I'm kind of like there's only two kinds of wheels in the world, stock wheels and crackers. But uh, I got those. And uh, uh, Lucas C. did a thing on these Firestone Drag 500s a while back. And I really wanted a couple sets of those. A couple of sets of, got a couple of drag cars that I'm going to build. These are going to go great on them. Also, uh, Everybody's been doing this 69 Chevelle, so I got me one of those. I've already got the 68, and uh, in high school, my one of my teachers had a brand new one of those Chevelles, and uh, it was nice. It was nice. And the last thing I got, this is a, a decal sheet from Gopher Racing, and if I were going to design a decal sheet myself this is basically what I would do as you can see here it's all under hood decals stuff to go on your uh, there's stuff on there to go on your battery on your air cleaner uh, there's a uh, little Mopar and little Chevrolet emblems uh, the uh, engine call outs, uh, the stuff going your radio caution, hot, and all like that. Uh, that's the one thing that I've always found missing from decal sheets was the decorations for your generator, your starter, your battery, your uh, uh, electronic ignition boxes. Uh, that always have motocraft or whatever on them. Uh, back in the day, there was the uh, voltage regulators on Fords that always had a little uh, decal on the side of it that said motocraft. You know, those little things is what was missing from so many cars. You know, now, this one's also got radio faces and uh, air conditioning vents and brake discs. But you know, that's neither here nor there to me. I, I really want the ones that goes under the hood, goes on things. But it also does include some really nice 
Super B logos for you Mopar fans, and some Roadrunners. Uh, really nice Roadrunners. Uh, really enjoyed that uh, video yesterday that uh, uh, Raul put out uh, about uh, I, I I remember the Roadrunners when they came out 68, 69 but I did not remember that the Roadrunner on the 68s was just black and white it wasn't colored uh, didn't remember that Kind of strange, but uh, uh, you know, he, I, I find his historical information there on the uh, muscle car modeler. I really enjoy watching his shows because of the historical information. It refreshes my memory on some things, and uh, actually brings out a lot of things that I just don't know if I ever knew or not. Uh, I enjoyed cars, even even. When I was young, like that, and all these muscle cars were new, you know. Uh, I always enjoyed cars. But that's all I got for right now. Uh, haven't got anything done lately on the uh, uh, bills. I've been fighting pretty hard with my sugar. I've got a new insulin, and it's. I'm having a hard time getting it regulated again. Uh, I went from a long-acting insulin to a fast-acting insulin, and I've suffered some pretty bad sugar drops from it, and like that. And if any of you ever had a bad sugar drop, you know you're too weak for a couple of days sometimes to do anything. Just lay. But. Uh, the time being, that's about it. I am going to uh, try to come up with something for the uh, cancer awareness build. I've been in that one the last several years and do intend to get into it this year. But I hadn't decided yet what I'm going to build or what uh, color I'm going to build it for. Uh, I've done all the ones in my family so far that I know of. Uh, I can't think of anybody that I've left out that didn't include my other bills so I will be uh, coming up with something on that a little later but I'm dragging and babbling and I hate when people just sit and babble and don't do anything don't tell you anything but y'all have a wonderful Sunday have a blessed week this is J.E. signing off bye bye